When a team gets named Minor League Baseball Team of the Year out of 400 plus nominations, you know it's something special. Well, the Quad Cities Riverbed has got that honor from Ballpark Digest just this month. Dave Heller, proud owner of the Bandits, joins me now with also that and the Field of Dreams news. Oh my goodness, you're just full of news now, Dave. We got a lot going on. You do, <laughs> how fun for you. And with the season just starting, yes. how's it been so far? Oh, it's exciting, Isn't it's it great. I mean, you know, this is the team that won the Midwest League Championship last year. We're mm -hmm. defending our title. Um, we scored 18 runs yesterday. We won 18-1. to see? one. So yeah. I'm feeling really good about things. So uh, when you got this, the word about Ballpark Digest, first of all, what, for, for folks who don't know what that might mean. Yes. Is that a magazine? What is it, a site? Uh, so it is. Um, it, it's the gold standard in our industry. That's the site. That's the website that everybody reads every day. That's the homepage for most people in our industry in minor league baseball. Okay. And for them to say, as you said, right, there's hundreds of minor league teams all over the country. And for them to choose us as the minor league team of the year, that's a big deal. And it's a, it's a nice reflection on Joe Kubley and Paul Kleinhans Schultz and Josh Michelson, Seth Reeve, our, gener our assistant general managers, and the whole staff there. They've just done such a great job. So, so what it means, Dave, is, is for the team, for the, for the, the stadium in general, I mean, it's the, all whole, of it. the whole, the whole yeah. package. Yeah, it's all okay. of it. Okay. It's all wrapped up into one award. Mm -hmm. and so what, so do you, what do you get for that? What, are, what is the result of something like that, you think? Well, the result is... You, Bragging rights only or what? Well, you get, a, you get a nice little trophy that you can, you know, mm -hmm. display in your front office, which is fine. But no, I mean, you get the recognition that you've done something really kind of special. Yeah, and the community hears that locally here and it says, well, okay, yeah, we have something in our own backyard that maybe I haven't tried for a while. It, Paula, what's really nice is so many times when these national awards are given, they're given to the coasts. Right, people on the East Coast, people on the West Coast, mm -hmm. and we in the Midwest who are doing so many neat things are overlooked. And so to me, what's really cool is getting the Quad Cities national recognition because there's so many people here who are doing so many awesome things that are not recognized nationally. Well, you know, when you look at Field of Dreams, I mean, that's really what put us on the map yeah. globally, I think. And, and you know, last summer when, um, you know, even though it's, it's Iowa, Dyersville, right. but when, you know, Kevin Costner came <laughs> and, and all of that happened, now when you guys are gonna play this yeah. August, what did you think when, you're, when that came down? Oh, I was so happy, I was so excited. I mean, we had been lobbying minor league baseball for, a major league baseball, mm -hmm. for a year on this issue. And just constantly, constantly, you know. Is it political, what? I mean, it's yeah, kind of sure. sure, sure. What isn't right? Right. But, but to get picked, like to have all that work come to fruition yes. was really nice. And it's so great for everybody in our community who got to watch the Yankees and the White Sox mm -hmm. last year on television mm -hmm. to be able to know they can get on a bus or they can get in their car, drive up to Dyersville an hour and 20 minutes and actually see it and experience it for themselves oh. live. How neat is that? That will be awesome. And people are really um, chomping at the bit, wondering when they can get the tickets. I know that yeah. has not been released yet. No. It's, but, it's not known. But, but we know this. Um, I've got Major League Baseball to commit to us that Quad Cities River Bandits fans will have a pre-sale window before it goes on to the general public. Oh, that's great. So we're excited for that too. So it's us in the uh, Cedars, uh, Cedar Rapids Colonels too. Yes. Yeah, so, so fun, kind of having a whole uh, uh, Iowa experience there. One other thing you wanted to mention, Dave, something that just happened with the team as well. So we got one other award. We won the, uh, the Matt Minker Award from the Kansas City Royals. Oh, that's right. For being the outstanding organization in their hmm. outstanding team in their organization, and that was kind of neat too. Well, I think just what um, what you guys have meant to the community uh, continues, and we just want to grow it. And I think, well, you've really got the launch points now to grow. We're excited. You know, yeah. I I have the best job in the world. I get mm -hmm. to stand at the top of the steps every day and greet the best fans anywhere in the country yeah, that's true. every day. I love it. Well, Dave, we love that you're here and you're here in the Quad Cities helping us grow strong. So uh, so thanks so much. And uh, we'll be uh, we'll be watching. We'll be watching when we can get uh, these great tickets for the uh, for the big game coming up in, in August. Yeah, August uh, 9th uh, is yes, the game. Yes, August 9th is the game in Dyersville. That's right. And Paula. This week we're home. Mm -hmm. We've got free t-shirts to give away on Tuesday. 
We've got free Ferris wheel rides on Wednesday. We've got free pine classes on yeah. Thursday, fireworks on Friday, and a free pennant giveaway Saturday. Oh, man, it ought to be, it ought to be summer. <laughs> we're, we're looking forward to this day. Maybe you guys could change the weather, and then we'll have it. Your Perfect. weather guy says 60 degrees I all know, weekend. I know. Mid 60s it, this week. Eric's going to take care of us. Eric's got us hooked up. Mid 60s all week. Dave is awesome to see you. It's Thanks wonderful so to see you. Thank Thanks, you. Paula.